Alright everybody, this movie is a little different than the train movies that are on this channel. But I was in the search for a coffee maker, and I found a decent one here, but I could not find any online video reviews to see how practical this machine is. This is a Black & Decker Mill & Brew 12 cup coffee maker. I believe the model number is CM5000B. Okay, so we got Thomas on top of the coffee maker. We have it programmed. It's never too late for a cup of coffee. So first we'll go over the internal pieces. Most of this can be taken apart very easily for washing after each cycle. I do not know the terms of these the terminology of these pieces so we will just kinda use some basic language. I have just washed all of these it just drops right in. We'll call that the outer basket and this is gonna be the inner basket it has the grinding blades permanent filter does need to be washed out after each use which it has been and on the top I believe this was called the shower head so all of these pieces go together very very easily so and they recommend one cup of beans per cup a little much for me it's got a basic house blend Kona blend pretty good you can also use pre-ground coffee works just fine so we'll move Thomas, here is the water reservoir. Yeah. Holds 12 cups of water. Yeah. And we have our carafe. Mm. We'll pour the water in. There is a heating plate mm. that keeps the coffee warm. There's a hole there that water will come out if you have more than 12 cups. So you shut that. Put the pot right there. And I do believe we'll make the Kona Blend coffee. You can almost smell how good that is. So, for 12 cups, I will be only using 4 or 5 tablespoons. Okay. So, as you can see, the whole beans are placed inside. Then we shut the lid. Then on the front, this is the grinding indicator. The four means four cups. Six, eight, ten, twelve. Grinding off. This will be the setting used for pre-ground coffee. We will do four. Might end up being a little coarser, but that's okay with me. So we got the beans, the water, Thomas, pot is in place, and we push the start. And that was the grinding cycle for four tablespoons of whole coffee. And the coffee will now brew. Brewing a full pot takes about five or six minutes. 
It starts up pretty quick. And it already smells pretty good. Thank you for watching. I hope you enjoy this. And if you're out looking for a new coffee maker, I do recommend this. Have a good night.